All right, how's it going guys? So today I'm going to be showing you how hackers spread their malware. Now, keep in mind, doing this is illegal, which is why I'm not going to be doing this for a long... It, I'm showing you how they spread it, okay? This goes to 127.0.0.1. I do not gain anything from this. As a matter of fact, I'll make a new one just to prove it to you. All right, I'll go full editor settings, all that stuff. See? It's pointing back to me. I'm gonna build it. Test 2. Save. Now we've got test 2, and I'll even put this in the trash and show you. And then I'll go back. So, this will not, this malware right here will not sacrifice anyone's security. It's not encrypted, so people's computers, the antivirus will find it instantly. Okay, so I will be gaining nothing from this. Why is my screen getting darker? Oh, that's why. I accidentally unplugged my laptop. Well, my charger is messed up for my laptop, and so it keeps doing this. It's really annoying. All right, there we go. My laptop is charging again. It doesn't need to charge, it's got a full battery, but I'll leave it charging because I use it a lot. I, like, every time I go somewhere, I take it with me. And it's really inconvenient to only have like a third of a battery whenever you're going somewhere. Because then it dies like ten minutes in. But anyway, I'm going to go here. Can I drag and drop? I want to drag and drop. I can drag and drop. And it's asking me to open that. No. So, you're going to go here, you're going to upload your file, and then after that you can either spread it on YouTube.com, on Facebook, Facebook, <laughs> Facebook, or the Pirate Bay. Keep in mind, the Pirate Bay is not for, the Pirate Bay, a lot of illegal stuff goes on here. Like, seriously. But, I'll show you the way that hackers spread on each one. Alright. First thing they're going to do is they're going to encrypt their malware and then they're going to upload it to some sort of website or make their own. It doesn't really matter. Alright. For the majority of the time, they're going to be uploading it directly to a website. So, they're going to upload their malware. I'm not going to do it here because I won't be able to take it back down whenever I do. But uh, then they're either going to go to YouTube, Facebook, not the Pirate Bay. YouTube, Facebook, Pastebin. I believe it's pastebin.com. I'm not sure. I could be wrong. Yep, Pastebin. But Pastebin is pretty common, because what you'll do is, like, all right, you'll upload your malware to somewhere like FileDropper or Mediafire.com. In case you can't understand my accent, that's mediafire.com. Alright. They'll go there, they'll upload their malware, then they'll go to YouTube, Facebook, or Pastebin, and they'll either make a YouTube video that says, Hey, I got a cool game mod for Grand Theft Auto V. <laughs> or whatever. Or, here's an idea, RuneScape... Gold generator. Alright, let's see what we get. This is like one. Yeah, this is probably malware. So let's look at this. This is probably malware. Scrolling down too far. Turning off autoplay. Alright, so let's just check this out immediately. First thing I noticed cane. Cane enable. That's a hacker type thing to do. Click here, change the. And it won't let me. All right, I'll minimize it again then. Can enable. Oh, and there's dark comment. So let's see what the comments said. As you can see, there's this link, the download link. What is your email ID? I need some help. How come you never show us in game? Probably malware. Doesn't come up on my computer when I try to run it. Alright, that guy's probably a retard. That guy knows what's up. That guy's a retard or troll. 
Put up new link, yada yada yada, download doesn't work, can't download it. Hmm. Apparently he went through and cleaned out all the people calling him out on it. Let's go newest. But yeah, a few people are calling him out on it, but yeah, that's like a 100% chance of being malware. So, he made a video describing the malware, well, not describing the malware, with a fake hack. What is going on guys, John here again, bringing you yet another RuneScape hack video. Today I'm going to show you how to use my brand new RuneScape 3GP generator version 2.14, brand new for RS3 guys. I know you guys have seen a bunch of sh videos out there but this is the real deal you don't even need your name or your password you do not need your username or password for this and I'm gonna explain everything in one second so a lot of people have been like oh this is a virus why has why have your stuff uh, why have your files been coming up as a virus on my computer well let me explain a couple things guys viruses well, first of all, you need to understand that you are downloading a quote-unquote hack. You are downloading a quote-unquote something that is going to modify either your computer or it's going to mod modify some sort of game code. And these things to antivirus companies are considered viruses. But to people like us, uh, programmers like me or just a regular player like you, is considered a cheat, a hack, something like that. So yeah, you see how he's sailing this. He's acting like it's not malicious. I can almost guarantee you it is. It's got to be Dark Comet, because he's got Dark Comet on his desktop. So not only is he being doing illegal things, I mean, no one's going to arrest you for this, unless you're blackmailing people or something like that. But you can see how he's doing it. I'm not going to show you his whole video, because that's a bit of a jerk thing, even if he does deserve it. Like, he doesn't deserve to make any money off of this video. I've got an ad blocker on to just so he doesn't but another way is they'll go to Facebook they hack a Facebook account or whatever and then they get in your Facebook account they'll create they'll create a post that says something along the lines of hey this game is amazing download it here <laughs> and then someone's like oh boy I wanna download that and then they get hacked Another way is going to paste bin, and you'll say something like, um, last Tuesday, the hacker group Anonymous, 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 there we go, Anonymous, leaked Lizard Squad's Facebook hack tool. I've personally used it and had 100% success. You know, something like that, and then you'll provide info like steps one Download two run three. You will see, like, you'll say, just spend more time on it than what I'm doing. I'm doing this real quick. You'll see a window asking for their username, input the account you want. To, you want to hack and hit continue for within 10 minutes you'll have their password something like that and then you'll put the download link and then you'll say whatever whatever your download link is you know you'll just say something along the lines of that YouTube videos tend to have a bit more success but you can do that on Pastebin or Facebook what I just showed you and then for the title of it you'll come down here and you'll say something like leaked lizard squad 
FB hack tool uh, new free you know just do something like that and then you'll and then you'll click create new paste and then you're done you just do that about a thousand times which you can do with Tor you just go into Tor and it, you can create I believe 10 posts like a day you can create like 10 posts a day with with all on the same without an account of any sort on the same IP address so whenever they block you for spamming or whatever for 24 hours you just go into Tor open it up and connect to it through Tor whenever they block you again you restart Tor etc you can do it an infinite amount of times and you're set or you can go to the Pirate Bay you can create your account which I'm not gonna do but well you know what I might as well so we're going to say register gorilla mail.com I use gorilla mail regularly we're gonna enter a username for go away you have to have ad blocker on if you're gonna go here because the Pirate Bay will show pop-ups. They'll open a new browser window and it'll be nothing but ads. Also, you'll have two giant ads on the side and everything and it's really annoying. So you'll wanna have an ad blocker of some sort if you go on here. There are other sites where you can do this, but the Pirate Bay is the most popular. You'll, for the username, I'll just enter completely cool guy no one has that name right and then over here we're gonna copy the email that's been generated for us you can either use this one up here the hrkzgfgo at sharklasers.com email or you can just copy this one or you can click this and then copy it because yeah just copy the email you're gonna enter that here for the password we'll say Cool space guy. Feel free to use my account for whatever. Cool space capital G G U Y. Then we'll go here eight eight three. Now this should work. Contains illegal characters, probably the spaces. Uh, can whoa. Uh, cool dude. I don't know. Just enter something along the lines of that. Username and or email address is already in use. Gotta be the username then. Um, I'll just start hitting random. Yep, there we go. I'm gonna need to copy that because I'm gonna need that later. Uh, one way. Alright. This should work. Wrong code. My goodness, what the heck? One, three, four. They really don't want me getting in. Ah, they can't keep me out forever. There we go. Confirmation email has been sent. Come over here. 